Hey nerds, welcome to Jerry Bear Reacts. Today we're going to react to Multi Male, Do I Want to Know? Which, if I'm not mistaken, is a song by the Arctic Monkeys. Correct? I could be wrong. Anyways, this is posted by Evelyn Jackson, friend of the channel. 785,000 subscribers. Posted back August 26, 2020 with 141,000 views with a runtime of 4 minutes and 22 seconds. So if you would like to watch that uninterrupted, a link will be in the description box down below, as well as a link to the Patreon, the Twitch stream, and everything in between. And if you're new to my channel, feel free to subscribe for daily content. If there's a day, there is a reaction. Now, Jerry does his best work behind the scenes, and we're going to go ahead and get straight into it. Boop. But you're in bulldog territory. Are you barking at her? Fight back. It's gross. <laughs> Okay, I just saw. Uh, there's so much happening already. I mean, isn't that Magnus? I didn't look. Goddamn Sherlock. You do. Aragorn, the Witcher. I didn't saw. Look, Kylo Ren. I didn't saw his dipshit ass. I didn't saw Walter White, Anakin. He got a gun. Okay, arrow. Oh, well, you're both dead. Listen, before this even gets going, I do have to make a note about this. While this was a heavy moment in the trailer, if you've actually seen the movie Joker, this scene is amazing, actually. The paint coming off from the tear, smoking or not, whatever, but just that power walk past the security of him coming into his own character as the Joker is so damn good. I love that movie. It's not the first time you've washed blood out of his clothes, is it? Sit down and shut up. You said what he said. Okay. Touch me again. Oh, that's the hundred, little buddy. Yo, it's Damon. Hey, Quicksilver. Underoos. Hey, everyone. Shout out to Kid for not being a snitch. I speak for myself. Normally, I love a dirty layer, but this one's just sloppy. It's Magnus. I know some things. You thrown a few at me. And I'm gonna lose it. Is that Klaus? He was pissed. Can we talk about the shitty winks they just delivered? You wink, but like your eye never like fully like close. I can't really wink that well with my right eye, but like the left eye, I got down pat. Like your eye didn't, like your eyes aren't even closing. His did, so that was Styles, right? The twins from Breaking Bad was wild. A little bit of supernatural action. Love that moment. Oh. I think we're in a gay club. Man, nothing gets past those keen werewolf senses, huh? That was Ripper Stefan. You can't address me like that. Sorry. <laughs> How long have you been training to be a prat? My lord. Is that Sebastian Stan? He caught that arrow. Good for him. Why do you think women are so attracted to me? Apart from the obvious. I was busy all day, Sheriff. You can check my browser history. You don't know what I mean. Ew. You are the hottest girl. I'm the hot girl. Yes, you are. I don't know what you don't understand about what Hello, I Kai. Said. Did I leave the stove on? <laughs> I'm so glad Deadpool was included in this. Dun, dun, dun. Not exactly is that Negan? Well, Dad, there's a conversation that we You're not gay. <laughs> I could be. Do you even know how to drive? What a perfect pause, by the way, because, again, another one of my favorite moments in cinema history is... Not only Hawkeye blind firing that and blowing that one up, 
with then the next arrow being pointed right at Loki and Loki catching it. I know how to do everything. All right, let me like, back to back because this is one of my favorite mo like moments in television history of him going up to Tuco and he's like, this isn't meth. And then this slow motion, first of all, how he got out unscathed, I'm not here for it, but this is the culmination of him becoming Heisenberg right here. <sighs> Perfect television show, 10 out of 10. If you never watch Breaking Bad, do yourself a favor and watch it. But you have heard of me. Son of a bitch! Go. I'm gonna cut ya. Oh, not from there. Let me help. Okay, piece him up. Right. Are you concentrating yet? That still counts as one! That still only counts as one! <laughs> I don't care. People are called victims. But when you do it, they're called casualties. Dead is dead, am I right? Who's that guy? Is it over? That was fucking fun, man. That was super fun. Um, 24-7 ambient music? So, bespoke post. I might have to check it out, actually. Um, there's really no thing, nothing to break down from that because it's a multi-male. It's just a bunch of male characters. Uh, the opening was weird. The bulldog bark bark thing was a little weird to old girl. That, that was super uncomfortable. Everything else was uh, pretty great, actually. That showed uh, practically everybody that I can... I obviously, if I took a second to think about it, I could probably pinpoint some people left out. But overall... A lot of Marvel, a lot of DC. I love the shot of Christian Bell when he was shooting the bow and arrow. Catwoman was up in his crib after he kind of retired in Dark Knight Rises. Love that Deadpool made it. It showed Walking Dead. That was one thing I was going to mention was um, Merle and Daryl Dixon. How great was those first few seasons of The Walking Dead? I say the first four seasons are perfect, actually. It's a lot of shows like that. First four seasons. Maybe they should take note. And keep that in mind. First four seasons of Game of Thrones, perfect. Granted, I love everything but the last season. First four seasons of The Vampire Diaries, perfect. First four seasons of The Walking Dead, perfect. And then you have Breaking Bad, which is five seasons. Technically, you could probably say six, but it's five with the split in the in the last season. Perfect. Would you, If you make a story, tell your story and get out. Get in and get out. Tell your story, have a start, have an end, fill everything else in between. You don't have to drag it out like The Walking Dead is doing. You don't have to drag it out like other shows have done. Um, some things don't need to be that long. The Vampire Diaries didn't need to be eight seasons long. You could have told that story in lesser time, more condensed. It would have had a more impactful moment episode to episode. But things happen for a reason. Anyways, this video is fucking chef's kiss phenomenal. And I'm going to go ahead and head out. I hope you guys enjoyed that as much as that, that shit was all over the place. And I saw things from multiple shows I've watched reactions for. I love seeing Damon. I love seeing Stefan. And uh, on that note, I'm going to head out. Links to everything will be in the description box down below. Playlist will be up on screen. As always, stay cute, stay hydrated, and I will catch you on the next one.